What's up everybody, Mojo Jijo here, playing some more Destiny, welcome back to episode 12. If you guys remember what happened in the last episode, we got done with the Fist of Crota. It was not a very long mission, but now we have more missions that we've got to do. Now, like I promised, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to go do that little strike in the summoning pits that is on the moon. Alrighty, so now that we're in orbit, we're going to go set our destination. Oh... Alrighty, Siege of the Warmind, we'll actually do that in the next episode. Alrighty, so time to do the summoning bits. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is a strike, so it is going to require three people. Uh, you can do it with friends, you can do it with uh, randos. So, I am going to have to look for two random people, so please be patient. Alrighty, so now that we found two other people, Something dark stirs in the let's see how we do. Now, this is, like I said, it is very hard, so uh, if you die a lot, don't be, don't be angry, it's nothing. That's only how you get better, is by dying. Not in real life, though. Alrighty, so now we are on the moon. Now, is it just me? I think it's just me. Yeah, I think it's just uh, me, ladies and gentlemen. Alrighty, well, looks like more XP for me. Sweet. Well, looks like uh, you possibly get to see me solo a uh, solo a strike. That's kind of awesome. Um, I just saw you drop something. Oh, here it is. Boom! Alrighty. Who? Let's see this. I know I'm being shot at. Kill these guys before. Oh, nope. Now we got a teammate. Uh huh. I was for sure I was gonna solo it. That's okay. Let's kill this guy, though. Let's just beat the crap out of him. There we go. Alrighty, so. Can't summon our sparrow. But, whatever. We are going to go down the steps. So if you remember in Sword of Crota, we are just basically going to be going down the same way, but a little further. Alright. Let's reload. Oh, and I'm getting hit. Ready? Bam! Smack to the face. Alrighty, I don't think I'm hitting her. Ladies and gentlemen, I do apologize if uh, I am really bad. Pow! Alrighty. Now for this part, we're gonna have to go through three waves of enemies because. We need to get uh, Nolan Bai is going to have to decipher this. Deploy ghost. A triptych of hive rooms said to be uncrackable. Alrighty, so we're spawning restricted. They know we're here. I'll get to work. I 
can I jump? There we go. Now I can jump. Okay, and I can't move. That's all right. There we go, there we go. All right, teammate. I'd prefer you to move out of the way. There we go. Basically, my grenade killed it. Whew. Oh. Alrighty. Thank you, teammate. Smack him. Smack him. Give him a good smacking. Alrighty. Mm -hmm. Oh, I had to reload. I ha I hate having to reload all the time. Let's take his health down. Kill him. Oh, okay. Let's pull out my chain gun and kill this dude. Oh, I got a ton of recoil. Holy crap. Oh, no. Okay. You know what? Nah, I won't use it. I'll save my uh, Nova for later. Just five finger death smack him. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, teammate. You cut up help me, buddy. That's okay, it's not his fault. I'm just being stubborn with my uh, stuff. Well, hi there. So nice to meet you. I think we killed you. I'm starting to sense a pattern. Shouldn't be long. Gotcha. Alrighty. So two of three runes are decoded. Now we have one more. Oh, that was brutal. That was brutal. Alrighty, so I'm going to end up switching back. Actually, yeah, I'll do my uh, scout rifle. Alright, now I got to move. Whew. Just toss my grenade up there. Already. Now this witch is almost dead. It's alright, I got gotcha, you, I got gotcha, you, I got gotcha. you. Whew. Boom. Now she's dead. Five finger death slap you. And just get right in your face. That should be all that needs to be coded. Yep. Got it. The gate's opening. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go through this door and keep going down. Alright, and then we're going to come into this room. Nope, no, 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 no. You stick over there. You stick way over there. Alrighty. I'd rather not be blown up by you, buddy. 
Let's kill this guy. Whew, he took a chunk of my health. There we go. Alrighty. So now we're gonna go through that door. We're gonna go through this dark, ominous hallway. There's the loud roar. So, you're gonna come across these bridges, come down to Circle of Bones. You're gonna take a left, and my person can't run. Okay, there we go. I was about to say, why can't I run anymore? So, you don't have to kill these guys, not really optional. Well, I mean, kind of is optional. You can kill them. You don't have to kill them. Kind of like these guys, you can just bypass them. Without having to put in, like, all your bullets. I'm just going to kill them because it's worth uh, XP. Whew. Now, some of you have been probably screaming at your TV to for me to use my Nova bomb. I am saving that. I'm saving that for this boss. Yes, it won't destroy him, but it'll definitely injure him. Oh, come on, dude. Stop playing around the freaking Rosie. There we go. So, I only kill those guys because it's XP. Now you're gonna run into this room, take a right, and boom. This guy. Well, Hive Abomination. So, let's just shoot him a couple times. This should unlock the fact that he's going to burst out of his chains. Um, let's see. Let's shoot him like a couple more times. Five finger death slap. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. He's eventually gonna break out of his chains. Yep, just like that. So I'm just gonna use my Nova Bomb. Boom, would you look at that? Did a little bit of damage, not a whole lot. Like I said, it would at least injure him. Alrighty. Oof, I'm getting hit from above. These are some pretty gnarly hits. Ladies and gentlemen, also if you want to, there is a little, uh, little glitchy poo over here. If you sit right in the crevice of this rock, and every once in a while you can peek up and you can crouch down, peek up, crouch down, and don't do what I did. But he'll definitely like try and shoot at you where he can't. Whew. These guys need to stop hurting me. this guy at least try to bow alrighty um now this guy's weakness is his stomach so let's see if I can get his attention over here that is his main weakness as you can see the yellow numbers are saying 32 so if I pop out my sniper Blast in the stomach. Oh, I missed. If he lets me, there's a lot of freaking like motion within his stomps. Oh, okay. Oh, and I missed. Alrighty. Now, what I'm gonna try and do is I'm gonna try and gain my super back. Because 
that would actually help a little bit. Kind of looks like a an enemy further in the game. You're very blue, dude. And I just died. So, be careful. There are hive ships that do come around. Alrighty, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And also, if you notice, there is a gold chest there. Whew, I just got smacked. So, I gotta just keep running. Ooh, no, 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 buddy. Why would you do that to me? You know, I know why I did it to you was because I actually didn't mean to do it. So we'll just kill you. Ready? And we'll come to your wet rescue. Rescue. We'll come to your your rescue. Alrighty. So we saved him. Now, basically, your goal is to try and shoot him within his stomach. Alright, I'm gonna sit over here. Because this guy comes on over here. Oh, yeah, see, there he is. There you go, buddy. There's a grenade for you. All right, all right. Um, let's take you out really quick. Let's gain our super back. All right, real quickly, I'm gonna go grab this golden chest. This should be four out of five that you ladies and gentlemen have found. Alrighty, 57. Okay, we're gonna go with the 57. Wow, he's barely losing any health. Alrighty. So, this is not actually going to take a little bit because it's not the easiest. It's actually quite difficult. Considering the fact that you have enemies upon enemies spawning on you. And you have to kill this giant guy. So... As you can see, we taken him to, or we have taken him to half health, and we are almost done. So, let's throw another grenade in there for him. Come on, buddy. Just slap you a couple times. Alrighty, let's get our heavy in there. Shoot him a little bit. Alrighty. Wasted all that ammo. Good thing I did. Because... <laughs> oh. I just did. <laughs> oh, looks like he threw a grenade. Come here, buddy. Come here. I know you want to come for me. Uh-oh. It's all right. It's all right. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. So I'm going to revive him. And just make sure you're putting some DPS on him. Uh, if you guys don't know what DPS, it's just damage per second. Make sure you're giving him all that you've got. Because if you're just two manning him or if you're just blatantly soloing him because no one else will join, Make sure you do have people that do want to play because, I mean, this is a pretty difficult game without a little group. Whew, that was a close one. I would have been toast, literally. Jeez, they're just sending out the 
bombers already. Ooh, I missed. Yeah, let's just continue shooting him. He is almost dead. My teammate better not stand there. Ooh, I better not stand here. Ooh, get mauled on. Now this actually takes quite a bit of focus, I will say that. And yeah, would you look at that, I have my super again. No, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. I don't want to be shot. I'm gonna go hide in this corner, screw it. Alrighty, let's hop up here. Let's hop up here. Uh oh. What are you doing, bud? Boom. Now he's dead. Nova Bomb was the last thing to kill him, which is kind of sweet. Revive him. And look at that. We got freaking engrams. Nice. Ooh, nice, nice. Very nice. A creature of the dark has been. Boom, an 82. That means we can actually put on our good stuff. 81. Growing among the darkness. Ooh. I fear we may find out all too soon. We got quite a bit of good stuff. Very, very nice. You know what? Boom! Yeah. That is how you win at the summoning pits, ladies and gentlemen. Whew. We didn't get anything there, but that's okay. You won't get, you know, you won't get everything every time. Or you won't get something every time. It's just a luck thing. Uh, ran it's basically randomly generated. So now what we're going to do is we are going to go back to the tower. And since we're waiting for the tower, uh, during strikes, ladies and gentlemen, you always want to have three people. That was difficult by itself, considering that I had me and another person basically going at it with this hive abomination. Now, he was a giant ogre, of course. Everyone could tell. Um, it's just make sure you have three people. It just makes everything easier. Instead of just one person keeps dying you keep dying and you guys are both trying to put dps on on him it's just really difficult so please 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 try and make sure to have three people even if it's a random try and make sure you have three people all righty master Raul, what do you have for me let's see what you've got please 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 give me something good all righty all right, I have a feeling that blue one's gonna be good. Oh, I have to be level 13. Alrighty, not bad, not bad. Ooh, I have to be level 13 for this as well. Okay, alrighty, alright, alright. So we're gonna talk to Xander here really quick because he's got bounties for days. Arc abilities, don't have that. Um, grenade kills, I do have that. Solar weapon kills. Possibly do that. Take and defeat it. Don't have that. Patrol in the Cosmodrome. Uh, collect resource nodes, open chests, and kill enemies in the Cosmodrome. Okay. Well, we can do that. And do the top three finish. Complete a match with at least ten kills and no more than seven deaths. That's possible. Ability kills. Kills while leading. Payback kills. Special kills. Okay, well, I just basically got everything there. But thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, follow, comment, subscribe. Do whatever really helps out the channel, like always. I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye.